A woman in India miraculously gave birth naturally to the infants who are attached to the abdomen, but left within a few hours. Doctors, who were unable to tell the gender of the children, have said they are vulnerable to health complications because they share an umbilical cord. The twins were born on September 2, and each baby had all its limbs and vital organs. The gender of these babies will only be revealed during surgery," said Dr. Rahul Agarwal, a pediatric surgeon at Bhiwani Prasad Hospital in Uttar Pradesh in northern India, who delivered the twins. They each had four limbs and a heart and other organs, but being attached to the abdomen and sharing the same umbilical cord made blood circulation challenging. If they had had an umbilical cord each it would have made them much stronger babies. Now, they desperately need surgery so they can go on and have a chance. She had no idea Dr. Agarwal said the 32-year-old woman from a nearby village admitted herself mid-labor and scans quickly revealed she was expecting twins. They showed they were attached to the abdomen with a length of 75 centimeters, 29. Five inches from one head to the other baby's head. He said the mother had already started with labor pains when she arrived at the hospital. We prepared her for labor, but within an hour she delivered naturally, which was miraculous. It's very rare. The woman bravely delivered the twins and fortunately all did fine. The mother was reportedly shocked to see her babies, but bonded with them instantly. It was amazing to see the two babies, Dr. Agarwal added. If we stimulated one, both of them would react and start crying together. However, I refer them to a better hospital with advanced medical facilities so they can seek further treatment. I can only hope they seek further help. The surgical separation of conjoined twins is a delicate and risky procedure requiring extreme precision and care. In cases of twins, where the pumping chambers of their hearts are conjoined hearts, there are no known survivors.
Although success rates have improved over the years, surgical separation is still rare. It is only after twins are born that doctors can use magnetic resonance imaging, ultrasound and angiography to find out what organs the twins share. In order to determine the feasibility of separation, doctors must carefully assess how the twins' shared organs function. The muscles in their backs are constantly being flexed, and they often have a difficult time bending their backs forward and backwards, and sitting up straight. 